Three years ago, when the world was suffering from the mental stresses of a pandemic-induced lockdown, a young man was also suffering mentally, albeit due to different reasons. The Punjab-born centre-back had emerged as a shining star for the national team during the 2017 Under-17 FIFA World Cup that was held in India. Till then, he had a promising career and looked set as one of the brightest young defenders from India. Ali is one such defender who has demonstrated his match-reading prowess from a young age. He possesses strength, confidence and elegance all at once, effortlessly executing every action accurately and delivering it with remarkable ease. Anwar Ali has reached remarkable heights in his career, but his journey stands apart from the common narrative that most modern footballers share. Unfortunately, back in 2019, the defender faced a major setback after he was diagnosed with a rare heart condition, posing a risk that his football days could be over. He was advised by medical experts not to continue playing football, a game that he held so close to his heart, which was all he had in his life to earn his livelihood. Soon enough, the AIFF banned or disallowed Anwar Ali to take part in any competitive matches. In a video posted by him, he pleaded, Please don't take football away from me. I won't survive. Later on in an interview, Anwar explained how difficult the situation was for him and his family. That was a very difficult phase of my life. Everything looked set before that. I had a good time in junior football and I was looking forward to playing the ISL and maybe making the senior national team debut one day. But now, I was being told that I could not play football anymore. It was a very stressful time for me and I was going door to door in order to find the different avenues for me to continue playing. There was a point when I gave up, but my family kept on supporting me through the difficult period. I also had much support from my previous clubs. Then just 20, Anwar, along with the Minerva Academy owner Ranjit Bajaj, who played a pivotal role in his growth as a footballer and also helped him restore his career, filed a case in the Delhi High Court against the AIFF's order to suspend him from playing football professionally in the country. The AIFF committee, led by Mr. Pace, had made a case, after consultation with doctors from the Asian Football Confederation, that it was not safe for Ali to play again professionally. The case dragged on for two years, making Anwar unavailable to play for that duration. But he kept practicing with amateur clubs to stay in shape and maintain his fitness. Honing his skills at Minerva's academy, one which Ranjit still owns, I tracked Anwar for a year to ensure he is fit. He joined Tektro Swades United FC, a club in the Himachal State League, and he played 40 games that season as captain, guiding the side to a runners-up spot in the league, stated Bajaj. However, we did all the tests and even consulted Dr. Sanjay Sharma, the chairman of the FA Cardiology Consensus Panel, a fellow of the European Society of Cardiology, the cardiologist of Christian Eriksen, Danish international player who suffered a similar fate at Tottenham Hotspur. Sanjay had testified in favour of Anwar Ali to start playing again as he didn't see any problems. However, finally in August 2021, Anwar won the case and he was allowed to once again take part in the top-tier matches and was eligible to play for his life, as he then signed a document where he declared that nobody will be responsible if anything happened to him in the future. Soon, the federation finally gave a green signal for the defender to play, and after stints with Tektro Swades United and Ranjit Bajaj's club Delhi FC, with whom he appeared in the I-League 2nd Division and the 2022 Durand Cup, Anwar Ali was finally permitted to be back where life paused three years ago, at the doorstep of an ISL club. In the January transfer window of 2022, Ali joined ISL side FC Goa and made his debut. Anwar Ali had previously appeared for Mumbai City FC, who had paid a transfer fee to bring him from Indian Arrows, AIFF's developmental team. But signing for Goa after all this was special for Ali, and he later described, I feel this is my second life. And signing for such a big club like Goa was a great moment for me, says Anwar. He quickly made a mark with his play, earning major applause and eventually received a call-up for the senior national team in March 2022. Anwar was very happy and he later spoke about it. That was a big moment for me. Playing for the senior national team has always been a goal ever since I was a kid. But getting the chance after all this struggle made it even more special.
He marked his debut on 23rd March in a 2-1 defeat against Bahrain and later on the 14th of June he scored his first international goal in a 4-0 victory against Hong Kong during the 2023 AFC Asian Cup qualifiers in Kolkata. Not only did he play a crucial role in helping India secure qualification for the AFC Asian Cup 2023 in Qatar, but Anwar also had a moment of redemption when India lifted the Hero Tri Nation Cup in Imphal earlier in March 2023. his first ever trophy in international football this last year he has been nothing short of amazing coming from a point of absolute despair to playing professional football again and then to be able to play for the national team it's been quite special it was also a special moment for me personally i have not yet won that many trophies in my career and winning a medal for the indian national team was a great feeling Anwar Ali expressed upon winning his first trophy with the Indian team back in March this year. Soon Ali played a key role in helping the Blue Tigers lift the Hero Intercontinental Cup 2023 in June and the 2023 SAF Championship in July. Anwar paired with Sandesh Jhingan and built a robust backline which conceded just 2 goals in the 11 games India played this year, along with providing accurate long balls to the attackers and passing or building attacks. Ali created plenty of chances and opportunities in attack and set pieces especially. That's not the end of the story as Anwar says. I know that I must keep working hard in order to stay on the team. The Asian Cup next year is one of my targets and I want to be in the squad when we play. Everyone is focusing on the AFC Asian Cup where we want to do well. Of course, we will be facing some very good sides who are some of Asia's strongest, but even we also have our own strengths. which we will play to Anwar Ali is a true warrior with a never give up attitude despite all the uncertainties he made an indomitable comeback providing us with a valuable lesson on resilience the promising career that once seemed to be derailed was soon back on track despite all the struggles and hurdles Ali achieved his childhood dream of making it into the senior national team and playing for the country at the age of 22 Anwar has gone through some tough times in his career and has emerged as a level-headed youngster who shows his calm in the back four to establish himself as one of the country's finest defenders. However, the young man has faced his demons and has come back fighting in his career. However, Ali didn't give up. Instead, he only kept striding forward with the determination to make a comeback despite facing numerous medical as well as legal issues. We all face some struggles or the other in our life. Some of us are more than others, but we should never give up. I was on point of giving up but had some very good people around me who helped me out. I just hope the same for everyone else too. Also, those hard periods make you very and more level-headed and teach you a lot. Ali explained that tough stretch. He was also thankful to all the people who supported him throughout his journey. It's not easy to come through such periods, but thankfully, I had some very supportive people around me who helped me through thick and thin. and i will never be able to forget them said anwar every tale has a fairy ending and for anwar ali it was to be him signing for india's best clubs in kolkata giants mohan bagan on a four year deal and the best part he will be on loan from delhi fc whose owner ranjit bajaj is nothing less than a godfather to ali as per iftwc The total estimated package is said to be approximately 11 crores which is a massive amount for any footballer in India including a foreigner let alone Indian players. This was certainly not the end of his bright career and he is just getting started and he has his prime years ahead of him. The Indian national team is all set to participate in two upcoming tournaments Thailand Kings Cup and Malaysia's Merdeka Cup as part of their preparation for the AFC Asian Cup. The center back is now fully focused on the matches ahead but with his keen eye all set on next year's continental championship the 2023 AFC Asian Cup where he hopes to be the lead of the next gen India team. We hope that Anwar Ali's journey of a comeback that nobody had expected will motivate you in your life. Here we are signing off from another video with a valuable life lesson. Never give up. Thank you for watching the video.